No! Wait, does that have over level 12? Oh my god, I thought it's went ages! I can't wait to see it, I can't wait to see it, I can't wait to see it! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh! <gasps> Jeroonies and welcome back to a new video and I'm really really sorry this video is a little bit late I don't know if you can oh you can little bean of Rooney is on my chair behind me basically a couple of hours ago she was uh, with us in the kitchen I went upstairs Ali came upstairs as well and there was just a really loud bang I was like Claire was that you because I was like in the bathroom he's like no it wasn't me he ran downstairs and um, Evie was like in her bed looking like really sorry for herself he brought her into here and put her on this chair and I came downstairs and she literally looked as though she'd been crying and I just was holding her face and I'm like, she's not right. And I put her on the floor and like she couldn't walk properly. She was like all curled up and she was trying to walk and she couldn't. I started getting really worried. She was shaking really badly. So we rushed her down to the vets. The nurse saw her and the vet saw her. The vet said that she could. She didn't want to scare me, but she may have had a seizure. So obviously we're really, 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 really worried. It might have been nothing. She might just knock something over and then like freaked out. Or it could be something serious. But for now, we are just keeping an eye on her. She's perked back up again. She's really happy. She's absolutely fine. The beanie is fine. So don't worry. But I tried to keep you guys in the loop and also explain why my video is a little bit late so i'm sorry about that i actually have quite a bad headache because i like when something happens to evie i just go into ultimate stress mode like right we need to drive to the vets right now you'll call them on the way i'm gonna pick her up let's get her shoes in let's get a coat and i'm just like i need to save the beanie so that's why i have a little bit of a headache but we are back with pokemon beanie today in fact let's go ahead and have a little nosy at cutest little beanie i'm playing with my pokeball today oh <gasps> You're cute. Oh, you were started by a gust of wind. You're cute, but I'm really sorry. You're still not as cute as real life, Evie, okay? Oh, man. I forgot that with a Pokeball, it's kind of hard. Okay. There you go. There you go, Evie. She's like, Evie! So, so cute. Okay, so we've got little Beanie. Also, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I am still in Viridian. Fire. Oh, my gosh. Did you just see a Bulbasaur? <gasps> okay, I am going to go ahead and catch this Bulbasaur because... Up until this point, I was upstairs with Ali, uh, like before we even went to New York, and I was chaining Caterpies because I really wanted a shiny Butterfree. And I have something really, really cool to show you guys. But I've been seeing these little guys pop up so much, and I haven't been able to get one because I have been catching. Oh, I've only got nine Pokeballs left. Wow. Because I've been catching all of the little um, Caterpies, so I haven't been able to catch any of these Bulbas. And if you chain Pokemon together, chain up until the 31st Pokemon. Let me see if I can catch it. Okay. Oh, it's not a good throw, you guys. But if you chain Pokemon together, catch up until 31. That will be your maximum chain. And then just... Hey, we got ourselves some Bulbasaur! <laughs> Exciting. And then just kind of wait and see what happens. See what Pokemon pop up. You will get a rarer Pokemon. It will just become so much more common. I was seeing Beedrills. I was seeing Bulbasaur. There were Pikachus for days. It was real exciting. But let me show you guys what I did manage to get. Is it in the squad? It isn't. I'm going to have to move it in. Oh, Bulbasaur's so cute. I'm so glad I actually managed to get one because after seeing them all, I really, really wanted to get one. So, 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 so. Oh my gosh, I was like, a Mew just appeared. Claire, that's your own Mew. By the way, if you want a shiny Caterpie, this is the best place to go. Oh. Oh, I didn't even mean to bring you up there, little guy. Oh, you can have a little stroke since you popped up. At one point, I had, I think, 12 Caterpies on my screen at once. Ali has been trying to um, chain Growlithe, and he literally had uh, zero. A big... No, sorry, <laughs> that's a lie. He had four. He had four Growlithe on screen at one time. He's got zero shiny ones, though. And I was getting 16, so I got my shiny really, really quickly. I'm just going to head out of this forest for now. Oh. Back to Caterpies again. I'm not gonna catch it though, because I want to show you guys what I've got. And also, we need to buy some more Pokeballs. Okay, there we go. We're out of the forest. And there's my crush. Hey, crush. Hey, crush. Give me a little tips. Thank you. But you guys have seen... Ooh, the Lures effect to have one off. I was using Lures while I was trying to chain my shinies. Okay. I know I'm keeping you guys in so much suspense here, but I want to heal up my Pokemon. I left you guys right after I beat the gym last time, which was really awesome. We had Bellsprout literally just wipe the gym. And you guys have also suggested a name for him in the comments, so I will be naming Bellsprout. I also have a name that you guys suggested for me, you, as well. Thanks for waiting. Your Pokemon are all better. Okay, let me show you guys right now exactly what we've got. So, are they in my bag? Are they in 
I can't remember. Okay, the first thing I'm gonna do. Wait, how do I rename my Pokemon? Please don't tell me I can't just easily rename my Pokemon. See if it's in Pokemon box. Change name. Okay, there we go. So you guys said that because Lilith saved everybody in the fire, I should uh, name. Oh. No, that's not what I meant to do. I should name Bill Bellsprout as Lilith. How do I make it caps? Okay, it's down there. Honestly, I don't know if I will keep Bellsprout in the squad, but hey, at least there we go. We have Lilith the Bellsprout. You guys had a really cute name as well for Mew. You wanted me to call Mew Bubblegum, which I love because it's the kind of the color of bubblegum, so I think it makes sense. Hopefully it fits. <gasps> it does, so we've got Mew the Bubblegum. And now for my amazing thing to show you guys where is it seriously where is it ah look at it ah, it's a shiny caterpie you guys I had to catch a lot of regular ones before I got to this little shiny right here. He is obviously super adorable. He has boosted attack, lowered special defense. Meh, you kind of want special attack, I believe, for Butterfree, but never mind because check this little dude out. But shiny Butterfree looks amazing. I also really like Butterfree, so I'm super excited about him. He will definitely be moving into the party. Sorry, Metapod, we are bringing shinies only for this game. And also, I kind of feel like Bulbasaur needs to get moved into the squad. And if you guys have a name suggestion for Bulbasaur, let me know in the comments below and we can name Bulbasaur something. I'm kind of feeling like this is so brutal. If I'm going to have a grass Pokemon, I would prefer Bulbasaur to Lilith. You guys are going to have to let me know what you think in the comments below. For now, I'm just going to swap out Rattata. Okay, there we go. We have a new squad. Now we just need to buy some Pokeballs and then we can be on our way into the next part of our adventure. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna have to buy, what do you reckon, about, I'm gonna buy 20 Pokeballs, 2k, and then I'm also gonna buy, <gasps> they give me two Premier Balls as a bonus, what? I'm gonna buy some Great Balls, I'm gonna buy myself, oh wow, 10 Great Balls, and then I'm kinda out of cash, so that's it. Oh, and he gave me a Premier Ball as well, okay, that's pretty cool. Nothing else we need for now. See if there's anyone worth talking to in here, because sometimes, uh, some, some guy is sucking him into buying a weird Pokemon. It's totally weak and it costs 500. <gasps> I wonder if it's a magic arm. I want to get Gyarados so much, but I would want to get a red Gyarados for sure. So maybe we can try and do that. Okay, I think this is the next direction I have to go towards, yeah, Route 3. So I think we're heading towards a cave and I also think we've got a lot of battles here. Is this my crush again? Oh, hey. Oh, hey, crush. He's the coach trainer. He trains trainers. They are strong if I do say so myself. Oh, coachy. If you want to try your strength, you should definitely battle us. Should we give him a go or should we train up a little bit first? I think I'm going to train up just a little bit first. We'll go to him as like the last trainer, I think. Okay, so we've got this last little baton first. Last Janus with her little angry eyebrow. Oh, it's settled down again now. She's uh, similar to me in that regard. Okay, grass versus grass. This isn't really a very sensible fight, but never mind. Let's just go for rap because it's not a grass type move. Oh, I feel so mean wrapping up cute little oddish like that. <gasps> He's absorbing my health. I don't think so. This is good because my wrap, I think, will like continue to hurt him. So that's good. I'm gonna use acid. I don't usually use bell sprouts. I'm kind of intrigued as to how they move. To me, they're mouth. Oh, wow. Okay, acid is strong. Acid is strong. Okay. <gasps> and Lily Bear leveled up to level 15. Good Lily Bear. Oh wow, I forgot that they all only have one Pokemon. So like I beat her already. And she gave me three Pokeballs. Wow. Okay, I'm going to switch up my party. Because we need to level up. Oh man. I don't want to... I don't want Caterpie to faint. Maybe we'll level up um, little Bulbasaur for now, okay? There we go. Okay, so we found some little Pokeballs by this bush. Mew's being all like, have you got something for me, Mew? You're just being cute, little Ben Ben. Oh, Be Bubblegum seems to want to touch Beanie's wagon tail. That's so cute. My Mew and my Beanie are friendos, you guys. So cute. Okay, let's fight this little kid here. Kind of feels a bit strange just going up to a kid and be like, yeah, I'm going to beat you up. Okay, we've got Youngster Calvin. Everyone only has one Pokeball. That's so weird. Okay, we've got a Spearo. Okay, Bulba, it's your first fight. Oh, you're a higher level though. You're fine. You're fine. Let's whip that vine. Little poet there for you. Okay, that didn't do much. Okay. 
Okay, okay. Yeah, it's super effective against you. We're gonna swap out, okay? We're gonna bring out the Beanster Rooney. Bulba, come back, friend. Oh, uh, it's really. She's like, why? Heck, what hurt me? Look at that. Belly even did a thing. Let's double kick his butt. Oh my god, it's like a big foot. Oh, critical hit! Beanie just one bagged him! Beanie! You're so clever! Hey, he lost. Lucky little side fit. How pretty is this game? Such a pretty game! So gorgeous. Okay. There was a Pokeball here, so I'm gonna have to get this. And then, like, circle back around. <laughs> I remember this route from the first game. Oh! Bubblegum wants some attention! Oh! So cute! Oh! <gasps> I love that we've got a Mew in our party. It makes me feel so special and amazing. And I love that it flies ahead. I think that's amazing. Okay, let's fight this girl here. Boy here. <laughs> Have some peach juice while I fight. Okay, Nidoran male. I feel like we can't get them in this game. They might be only in the other game, but I honestly can't remember very well. Okay, let's try Vine Whip on this dude. I, f I kind of feel like it's not going to do much though. Yeah, it's not very... F no! Don't you be sending poisons into Bulba? so mean bubblegum go show them how it's done i'm not gonna lie i can't remember my types very well i don't know if like poison's strong against psychic no it's not oh but my baby is poisoned no oh you can't do much right now can you <laughs> you need to learn some moves there bubblegum oh wow well done though hey okay we've beaten him but oh he gave us two great balls jeez that's good uh, I'm really paranoid about poor little Mew and Poison. So I might just rush back because in the old games, they constantly like died the whole time they were poisoned. So I am, I know this is really sad. I'm like, I can't bear any of my Pokemon to be hurt at all. I'm a big softie, okay? I want to give, I want to make sure Bubblegum's okay. Especially now it's got a name and everything. There we go. I'm going to rest it. And then when they're all back again, I think, because they've now got a shiny, It'd be pretty for cool for you guys to see a shiny following me, so I think I'm gonna swap out my follower Pokemon to my shiny Caterpie so we can see that shiny in action. Take out a Pokeball! <gasps> Caterpie will travel alongside me. I just think it's really tiny. <gasps> Look at it! Go <laughs> it's like... Blip, 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 blip. Oh, it's so cute. Look at it! It's so slow! Come on, Caterpie! Catch up, little bun bun! There you go. It's cool, though, because it's gold. It's gonna look really weird when it's just like a metapod trying to follow me. Look how slow it is! It has to keep zooming forward in the ball. That's actually adorable and amazing. Should we try this guy now? I think we give it a go. We want to try our own strength. Yes! Let's go! I wonder if he's more like the OG battles. Coach trainer Kareem. <gasps> look at his angry face now! <gasps> he's sending out Bulbasaur too! Well, this is gonna be a strange old battle, isn't it? <laughs> really? His is a higher level as well. Okay, okay. We're gonna have to call in the big guns. Let's go, Beanster. He's only got one Pokemon, though. How is he harder? How is he testing my strength? I kind of feel like he's not. I love that when I call EV out, she goes, if why? <laughs> okay, let's double kick his butt and show him who's boss. Look at that. Oh, oh. Okay. It's not very effective. Okay, wow. Oh, and now he's put some seeds in me. Great. I love the animation for that. Annoying that it was on me, but I still kind of love the animation for it. Okay. So we've given him, wow, a load of his health back. Okay, let's try just a straight up quick attack. That's more like it. Okay, he is vine whipping me though. Not great. And I'm still leech seeded, so he's still taking back some of my health. However, I feel like we could potentially end it right now. Maybe no. Okay. Okay, little twisty head. Sorry, I'm keeping an extra eye on Vino, but we won! We beat even the good trainers, guys. Bulbasaur grew to level 8. Clever chicken. Pidgey grew to level 15. Pidgey wants to learn wing attack. Yes, what should we forget, Pidgeroo? Let's forget... Uh, I'm just going to forget wing mirror move. Oh, that's kind of useful. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> nah, I'm going to forget mirror move, okay? I'm probably not going to take Pidgey to end the game, so it's not the end of the world. There we go. Pidgey's learned wing attack, and we beat this dude. You are good. Yes, I am. Oh, he's given us a gift to honor our strength. He's given us a revive? That's probably going to be useful, because I feel like we have to go into the cave next. I'm also going to swap out little Caterpie uh, to number one, because I kind of want 
him to get the most XP of all so that he can stop being a little tiny grub, you know? Okay, I wonder what Pokemon spawn here. A Spearow! Guys, we've not caught a Spearow yet. Spearow, come back! <laughs> okay, our first Spearow encounter. Let's give it a go. It's only a level three. Okay, I don't think we need a great ball. I think a Pokeball is going to be just fine. And let's give this a go. First ever Spearow. I'm not getting my timings very good, am I? Okay, one, two, three. Do -do 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 -do. We caught Spearow, guys. Let's have some victory peach. And these guys got XP. I forgot they get them from catching as well, don't they? Spearow's data will be added to the Pokedex. Can we see how many Pokemons we've added to our Pokedex now? Okay, our Pokedex is at 12. So that's pretty good. Not doing too badly. We got 150 <laughs> to try and get. I can't. Oh, an Ekans! You'll see. <laughs> You stay away from my little car to be okay. Let's catch ourselves an Ekans as well. Oh, this is good. I like just like catching loads of new Pokemon. Wow. I'm bad at throwing today. Okay. Two, three. Yeah, it goes green. That's so cool. <gasps> but it goes purple. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. There we go. Some XP for you, little cutie bears. And now we've got 13 Pokemon in the Pokedex, you guys. Okay. And we've already got Rattata. Okay, let's fight this lady. Eek! Did you push me? What? <laughs> Look at her throwing shade. I didn't go anywhere near her. Picnica Robin, how dare you? I do love your hair though. I'm not even gonna lie. <gasps> Look, it does a shiny animation when it comes out. That's so cool. Should I try and let it bite on its own? I feel like it's too garbage. No, I don't want you to get hurt, Lord. <laughs> You're too garbage. Let's bring out Bubblegum. Okay, Bubblegum. Let's go ahead and do some Swifts. I love the little stars. Yay! Well done, Bubblegum. And well done, Caterpie. Caterpie needs a name, okay? Definitely leave your ideas for Shiny. Don't name it as if it's a Caterpie. Name it as if it's going to be a Butterfree, okay? Oh, two great balls. Oh, look at her like this. Thank you. Okay, I can't see anything else here. The thing is, now I know that if you chain Pokemon, cool ones will appear, but... Oh, what was that? That was a Spearow. I thought it was a Mr. Mime for a minute. But, oh, how rude. This Rattata head just ran out to run away. I wanted to, like, battle it to train up my Caterpie, but obviously I can't. Okay, can see a Pokeball there. It's got a lure inside it. Got another fight here. This guy is the, is the one that talks about his shorts being comfy. He was definitely in the OG game. He's not aged a day, youngster Ben. He's got a Rattata. Go on, little Caterpie. Should I let him have his first battle? I kind of feel like I should. Love his shiny animation. Okay, Caterpie, go for it. You are slow, though. Yeah, I knew you wouldn't get in first attack. Oh, no, Baba. You're cute, but you are kind of garbage. Okay, let's send out Pidgeroo. Okay, Pidgeroo, you know what to do. Let's try this new wing attack move. I just like to see all the animations for all the different moves. Oh, look at that. All of the feathers come out. That's really cool. <gasps> why did Caterpie get a boosted 30 XP points? I don't really know why that happened, but I'm real happy about it. So, okay. A Bulbasaur and Leech Seed. Hey. <gasps> no way. Already? Caterpie is evolving. <gasps> this is the first Pokemon that's evolved. <gasps> it's so beautiful. Look at this fucking galaxy. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <gasps> It's red! Are you joking me? Oh, I didn't know it was gonna be red. That's actually a really cool shiny. It's, oh, I've annoyed Eevee too much. Some of the shinies are garbage, but that one's so cool! It's red! Oh my gosh. And he learned harden. Okay, I'm gonna send a picture to Ali because red is awesome! Okay. Oh, we might as well fight. Wait, I just want to fight as many people as I can. Let's get to his... Oh, let's get right to it. This kid knows. This kid knows. Oh, I'm going to send out my Metapod, aren't I? Against his Kakuna. This could be a real slow fight, you know. Look how cool it looks. Oh my gosh, look at it. I actually love that so much. That's a really, really cool looking shiny. I know it's only a Metapod, but still... Still, it is pretty kick-ass. I like that. Okay, this will be the slowest fight in existence, but I'm gonna give it a go because I really want it to evolve into Butterfree. And I think it has to be like level 25, level 30. Basically, it's gonna take a while. Don't you poison me. No. Guys, Metapod was poisoned. No. Okay, let's definitely switch out. You are kind of used to this Metapod. <laughs> I'm gonna bring Pidgeroo back out. Oh, wow. <laughs> Wing attack so good! Well done, Pidgeroo! Oh, Ali loves the way that Metapod looked. I knew he would. I knew he would. Okay, look at it! Oh, look at it following me! Oh, oh, oh! 
Oh, Metapod's telling me something's in here. <gasps> you got a raspberry? Thanks, Metapod. Is Metapod still poisoned though? Let me just check that out. It is still poisoned, but I don't want to go all the way back. Oh, what do I do? There might be somewhere to heal right before the cave. I don't think there is, but you never know. So let's see how we get on. And if all else fails, I do have a revive. <laughs> it's just loads of- Ooh, this guy might heal me actually. He looks very gentle. He's just taking a rest. Oh no, he's just warning us about the tunnel. Oh, it's another ace trainer. <gasps> do you want to train before- Yeah, let's go. So the next place is Mount Moon. You are challenged by coach trainer Oberon. Okay, what does Oberon have? Only one Pokemon again. <gasps> he's got a Meowth though. Ooh. I, don't, I don't think we can get Meowths in this version. I don't know. I can't remember half the stuff, I swear. Okay, because it's poisoned and because that's level 13, I am just going to do a straight switcheroo to Bubblegum. Go on, Bubblegum. I know you can do it. So cute. Imagine if I'd have got Mew and it'd have been shiny. How insane would that have been? <gasps> it's using Payday. Does that mean I can collect the money from it? I hope so. Okay, one more of those and we've won. Go on, little Bubblegum. Kapow! Well done, Bubblegumaroo. These tough trainers aren't quite as tough as they like to think they are. <laughs> okay, Bubblegum will move to level 16. But nobody else leveled up. Oh, I want someone leveling up. It was happening so much at the beginning of the game. Oh, and he gave us payday. Okay, this is good because if I use this in battles, you can get extra pocket money. So I kind of feel... Like, I should train somebody payday. It's kind of annoying because it's not a great move. Ah, oh, Beanie can learn it and Bubblegum can learn it. Oh no, I, I'm tempted to give it to Beanie. It's annoying that it's not a good move, but it is really good in that I'll get so much more money. And obviously I'm always gonna have Beanie with me. So I kind of feel like I should give it to Beanie. Eh, boy. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of Growl. There we go. Tell me if I just made a horrible decision, but hopefully I didn't. <laughs> Beanie learned payday. Okay, so this is good because Beanie could be getting us loads of money, you guys. <gasps> oh, and there's somewhere to heal here. Okay, perfect. Let's just chat with everybody else. Oh, she tripped over a Geodude. Got a little Pokeball here with an escape rope in, in case we want to get out of the cave again. I don't think I've ever really used them though. I came to Mount Moon Ma Ma for Fairway because I want a Pokemon I can ride on. You know that's going to be Onyx. Oh my gosh, guys, imagine if we can ride on an Onyx. That would be so amazing. I don't think there's anything else to get around here. No, there's not. Okay, let's head back in, heal our Pokemon. And should we try and get ourselves an Onyx? We definitely should, you guys. Oh, this guy called me a sweetie pie, which instantly I do not like. No thank you, friend. But he says he's got a deal for me. I'll let you have a secret Pokemon in Magikarp for 500. So you'll buy it, am I right? The thing is, yeah, <laughs> I totally will because you paid an outrageous $500 for a Magikarp. I don't know how long it is in the game till I can get one on my own. And the thing is, the thing is, it involves as a Gyarados. So if any of you guys want to be named after Gyarados or have a cool name for it, let me know in the comments below. And I think we should add that to our party. I know it's an outrageous amount of money. Should we check what its stats are as well? Okay, it's completely neutral, which is pretty good to be fair. That's fine. Actually, should I have it following me? <laughs> I'm gonna add it to the party. I'm not really vibing. Oh, I'm kind of tempted to move up Lilith. I know I've only just named her or Bulbasaur. I'm gonna move up Bulbasaur for now. And then I'm gonna get Magikarp to follow me because I feel like it's gonna be hilarious. Okay, Magikarp will travel alongside you. This is cruel because like, oh my gosh, look at it. It just feels wrong like you're hurting it. <laughs> like it's drowning above water. Ooh, and Team Rocket have been spotted nearby, you guys. Oh, a little Jigglypuff is singing for us. Oh, Jigglypuff, it's so beautiful. Thank you so much. Oh, who just fell asleep? Did I just fall asleep on Magikarp? Oh, he's singing this person to sleep. Okay. <laughs> the Magikarp following me is just cracking me up. <gasps> Look at the little sleepy Meowth up there. How do you get to it? It doesn't seem like a Pokemon will do very much. Oh my gosh, I want it, I want it, I want it. It's so cute. Look at it. <gasps> if we get a Meowth, we have to call it Oliver, okay? Ooh, it's Jesse and James. Oh. <gasps> Looks like there's nothing here. Then let's just search farther in. Oh, <gasps> you were eavesdropping on us. You were supposed to be keeping watch, Meowth. That was who was sleeping. Oh, little Meowth. We know there's rare fossils buried in here somewhere. And if you've got any, you better hand them over to us, twerp. <gasps> That's right. If anything is going to profit off those rare fossils, it's going to be us. <laughs> 
Oh, but we are meant to talk, isn't it? Still though. Oh, should we go catch our first Geo dude? Yay! How do we get an Onyx trip here then? Is it just gonna be like super rare? Get your Pokeball through the moving ring and you can get bonus for great technique. Oh, I like how the game literally thinks I'm so bad that it's not, it, it feels like it needs to teach me how to throw. That's kind of hilarious. Okay, see, I know how to throw, okay? Excellent. Two, three, yay! I can tell though by this already whether I've caught it or not. Or I could just look at the screen, but you know. <laughs> oh, two levels up, well done gang. Well done, gang. <gasps> Magikarp's level six. You're never gonna get used in battle of Magikarp because you're trash. And we've added a Geodude to the Pokedex. Not really a Pokemon I like that much though. And I knew it was gonna be super common. So I'm like, let's just get it. Let's just get it out the way. I don't know if it looks cool as a shiny or not. Azuma, you're new. Let's add you as well. Now these can be quite hard to catch because they like move around a little bit. Yeah, I knew it was gonna be harder to catch than you expected. Okay, oh wow, I skied that. Okay, let's try this again and go. Oh, Okay, that's better, that's better. Okay, one, two, three. Yay! How, how many new Pokemon have we added today? We've got Ek and Spiro, uh, Geodude, Zubat, uh, Magikar, Bulbasaur, six. I think we've added six new Pokemons. That's pretty awesome. Okay, we've got to keep our eyes open for Onyx because I really want Onyx, you guys. Let's do a few battles where we can. But Catcher Kent is here. Oh, he's got the Butterfree! As will look even cooler than that, you guys. Even cooler than that because look at our Metapod. Wait a minute, his Butterfree is level seven. How? How has he managed to do that? That's against the rules, okay? Beanie, come out and use your coin throw so we can get some extra money, please. Ooh, he's used confusion. Don't get confused, little buddy. Okay, he's not confused because the words, it hurt itself in confusion, are literally the worst words in the world. Okay, let's use Payday so we can get that cash. It's so weird, like why is he throwing out like a meal thing when he doesn't have a meal thing, but okay. And Butterfree fainted, now we should get a little bit more money. Okay, so you got me, you got 84 for winning, and you picked up another 80! So we literally doubled what we've got, which is obviously amazing. I pick up that, five great balls. <laughs> My magic art following me is actually just cracking me up. I love that it's actually faster than Caterpie as well. <laughs> okay, you might be useless looking at Magikarp, but you better be telling me if we're passing stuff, okay? I can also see Team Rocket James in the top corner. That's Evelyn, what's she got? A Bellsprout! We got a Bellsprout, guys. We got one. Okay, I'm gonna be super boring and just keep switching to Bean to keep using Payday. And because Bean can take a good few hits, like, she's okay. 160 for winning and another 80. I wonder if it's just like a flat out 80 every time. That's still really good. Still no Onyxes. Oh, it's Jesse. Still looking for these fossils, you guys. You're pretty fast, kid. Ugh. Okay, bye, Jesse. I do wish I had your hair, though, because her hair's amazing. Guys, where is Onyx at? Is there like a specific place I have to go, I wonder? Oh, who's this guy as well? <gasps> a drop of water fell down and startled it? What? Oh, Paris! You found an awakening. Okay, that's cool. But I want this Paris, quick! <gasps> Another new Pokemon! I actually, oh, it's huge! I actually don't like Paris because when we used to play Pokemon 3D, these guys were the biggest nightmare in the world. They would like stun you. Pokemon 3D was the series Ali and I had an arc. And they'd stun you and just mess you up. It was so annoying. It was super annoying. They were literally scarier than a Tyranitar. One, two, three. No! Oh, it's so cheeky. Come on, Parrish, you know you want to join my squad. All my Pokemon are real happy. Excellent. Okay, you literally can't get better than that. That was an amazing throw. Three? Are you joking me? You're a nightmare in this game as well. Good to know. I should have expected it. I'm gonna have to use a great ball. I'm just wasting balls here. This is so annoying. Okay, I'm going for the great ball. For a Paris. I, ah! <laughs> I don't even like them. I don't even like them. Eh, if you don't get in this ball right now, Paris, I swear to God. I swear to God. There you go. I was about to say I'll be serving you with some sweet and sour sauce, but I'm a vegan, so I wouldn't, okay? Just because it looks like a shrimp. <laughs> Metapod goes to level 10, yay! Magikarp goes to level seven. Wow, that was not an easy- <gasps> No way, does it have over level 12? Oh my God, I thought it's went ages. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> oh 
I can't wait to see. I can't wait to see. I can't wait to see. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's got pink legs. Look at it. Oh my gosh. I have to send a picture to Ali. He's going to love it. Look at it go. It's so cute. Okay, guys, we need a name for it. We need a name. It's wings covered in poisonous powder. Repel water. This allows it to fly in the rain. It's so smart. Good little smarty pie. Oh my gosh, look at it. It's so cute. It's so cute. Okay, you know it has to follow us. It absolutely has to follow us. It was worth catching that Paris, you guys. I didn't think it was going to be, but it definitely was. Okay, Butterfree, let's take you out the Pokeball. And let's see how it looks. <gasps> it looks amazing. We knew it was going to look amazing. Okay, this guy's just ruined my fun. <laughs> Saying don't sneak up on me, even though he's just sat in a crater. Okay. Oh, this guy's weird. Super nerd. Super nerd Yovan. Okay. Grimer. Ooh, Grimer. Cheeky. Could you get them in this cave as well, you reckon? Ooh, I should try and look out for one. Oh, it's so beautiful. Okay, let's use um Gust. Oh, Grimer's quite tough. <gasps> Don't hurt my little butterfly, okay? Just string shot. String shot doesn't really do anything. I feel like Gust might be my best move right now. I need to learn some new moves. Oh, he's getting hit. I am, however, gonna switch out to Beanie because Mula, <laughs> I want the money. I want the money, money. I know he's not saying money, but he sounds like he is. Okay, Beano. Poison Gus. Oh no. <gasps> he's poisoned Gun. We're quite near the exit if we wanna just nip outside and heal up. Okay, payday for the money from the super nerd. He's got a massive tablet or something, doesn't he? There we go. Grimus fainted. Let's see how much money you can get from a super nerd. <gasps> Beanie's leveling up. Well done, Beano. So proud. Beanie wants to learn bites, okay. Why don't you forget Evoi? Why don't you forget Tackle, okay? Beanie learned bye, Evoi. <laughs> and Lilith grew up to level six, grew up. Be Lilith wants to learn Sleep Powder. Yes, that is a super useful move. We are gonna forget growth. Okay, so Lilith learned Sleep Powder. That's super weird to say, it's an odd sentence. Give us 400 for winning. Oh, okay. I think it has to be a flat out $80 every time, you guys. I'm gonna swap my party Pokemon back to Magikarp being at the front just so that I can try and level it up quickly because Magikarp's trash. Gyarados is the bomb. <laughs> oh, this kid's got a monkey. Well, that's the first time we've seen him. Go Magikarp. Yay. You're trash. Zuba. Like, nothing new yet, you guys. I am just gonna heal up the bean because I don't want her to faint. My Pokemon far too much for fainting. Okay. Everyone's healed up. Let's head back inside. I want to make it out the cave. But I really want to get an Onyx as well. Do you think I have to train, uh, sorry, chain Geodudes to get Onyx? I'm kind of vibing that that might be what I have to do. It was like a rare spawn in the OG games, but you could get it without doing anything special like chaining. <gasps> oh, so we're going to throw it to this girl. She's got a Clefairy. Do you think I can get a Clefairy in here? They come from Mount Moon because they come from the moon. Maybe. How did she get one? We should ask her afterwards. I feel bad that Bean just comes in and one bangs all these Pokemon. <laughs> oh, everyone's only got one Pokemon too. Like, what is that about? Oh, this lady's too lost to help us with finding ourselves a little Clefairy, guys, which kind of sucks. Oh, it's James. Yikes, quit following us. I'm not following you. I'm exploring the cave. God. <gasps> He's got a Sand Shrew. Oh, they're so cute. Okay, end of the battle went 170 pounds that time. I think it's because I used the move twice. Okay, so we want to be trying to use it as often as we can, really. <laughs> Get more and more monies. Ooh, found a pearl. That's good because I can sell it. I'm just exploring this floor for now, so I've not actually gone through any of the ladders yet. Ooh, and we've got this guy that wants to fight with his big backpack on. He's got two Pokemon! Oh my gosh, the first trainer ever to have two Pokemon. I'm actually amazed. I'm actually amazed right now. Oh wow, Payday does not do much damage to this dude. That's good because you might be able to hit it low <laughs> and get loads of money, okay? Okay, he's fainted now. Hopefully we get a little bit more cash from him. Magic Harps at level eight. I think it's still got a long way to go before it's useful though. We already have two Geodude, which is not very exciting, but hopefully we get some good monies from it. 400 to win it, another 255, yes. 
That's what I like to hear. Still though, guys, no onyxes yet. What's this guy up here doing? Ooh, he's saying if we run out of Pokeballs and we talk to him, I feel like he'll give us some more, which is pretty insane. We're going down these little steps now. Still no onyxes. Oh, it's Meowth. Oh, he's so cute. He's not, he doesn't talk in this game though. He just does the Meowth noise, which is super weird. Oh, a Team Rocket dude. Okay. I think from this point onwards, we go on to like fight Team Rocket and also like pick a fossil so you guys are gonna have to let me know if, if it's like the og games is a choice of two fossils so you guys are gonna have to let me know which fossil i should get in the comments below i'm not gonna be catching this shoe because we already got ourselves one but also what i should name my butterfree and what i should name my uh future garados as well let me know in the comments below and i hope you guys you guys enjoyed another episode of pokemon let's go eevee i love it so much and i love my awesome beautiful sh <gasps> is this rare okay let's cancel the outro because there's a wild cut there Surely this is... Oh, it's, it's it's green, though. It's not that rare. But it's going to be hard to catch because look how much it's moving around. <gasps> Have we just literally got ourselves a Clefairy, Clefairy in the outro? No. <gasps> we got a Clefairy! Oh, my gosh. It's like fairy, 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 fairy. And we've got some level ups as well. Oh, my gosh. This is amazing. I'm so hyped. I thought... <coughs> I thought it would be so hard to get. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. Let me know if you want me to name that little dude as well. And I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. <laughs> Say goodbye. It's a cute little Beena Rooney. And I'll see you guys in another one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye.